oh my god i literally feel like it's been years since i made a video and i've just cleaned all the pets out so i just thought that i would kind of make a video so you guys can see that i am still here and i still have my pets and we are still going strong <laughs> um there's actually been quite a lot of changes since i made a video last i can't even remember what the last video was that i made um but unfortunately none of my original rats are alive anymore um daisy actually had a stroke and i took her to the vet and they gave me medicine and said that she'd be okay and she started getting better but um they said that there's over like a 90 percent chance that she would have another stroke um so unfortunately that is what happened and she did end up passing away um i'm so sorry about that noise my cat is in season so i'm waiting to get her um done but financial complications are uh the reason she's in season so she's going to be getting done next month let's just say so if you can just hear that noise that's her i'm really sorry um so i just wanted to introduce you to the new rats but first of all i just wanted to give you an update so obviously that daisy did pass away um when i knew her time had come i've had rats before i've had guinea pigs and all that so i kind of have a feeling in my heart and i'm a healthcare assistant so i kind of had this feeling like i know when something is going to happen so basically um when she went downhill really bad I put her in a box, um, like a travel case, next to my bed and I wrapped her up in a blanket. It's actually my nephew's blanket, it was a really soft one and I wrapped her up and um, I put her in my, well, not in my bed, like next to my bedside with me for the night. Went to sleep, I could hear her breathing, I woke up and I couldn't hear it so I knew she'd went but I know she went with me, she knew that I was with her when she passed away. So that's literally the only update I have. So furthermore, like basically... I've got two new beautifuls that I want to introduce you to um, when I first got them because Daisy was alive when I got these two and life's been a bit hectic at the moment. I literally, um, the reason I haven't made any videos is because I've just had quite a big operation um, probably less than a month ago so I've been basically off sick um, at home but I haven't been in the mood to do anything so please forgive me, I have got a genuine reason this time, I was re very poorly. Um, so let's basically just get into the video and let me introduce you to these girlies. So I'm going to introduce you to um, my two beautiful little girls. Their names are Cookie and Oreo. I know it's very generic rat names but I literally, they look like, um, well one looks like an Oreo and the other one I didn't really know so Cookie went with Oreo so that's what we came up with. Um, there's new things in the cage, if I'm going to give you a top cage tour, because I'm sure they'll come out as soon as they hear me rustling about. They are very tamed. Um, I can actually poke my fingers through the cage like this, and they brush their head on my fingertips. Um, they don't bite at all. I've tamed them. Obviously, I've been off, so I've had a lot of time to tame them. I've had them for about two months now. They've done really well. They've put on so much weight. They're, you know, they're really healthy. I did buy them from Pets at Home. I didn't adopt this time. I have a good reason. My reason in being is my sister-in-law just recently got a job at Pets at Home and she said to me that they had been in there for months and nobody wanted them and they basically were going to be transferred to the adoption bit. So like the bit where no one wants to buy them and they're such sweet little girls. I just so yes, basically that's what happened. I went in and took them home and introduced them to Daisy. They got on immediately. Um, I'm going to insert some pictures of them together. Um, I decided not to make a memorial video for Daisy just because I've made so many recently. I did not want my, cage, my page to be so depressing. Um, so I decided not to. I know that I love her and that's all that matters. So I'm going to give you a little cage tour. Um, be mindful of the bottom. I'm not going to show you. Um, just because it's a huge mess. I can do it every day but they make their own nest so I just tend to leave it because it's what they want. So over there is their litter tray which is actually a box that I've just taken the lid off. It's the only one that I found was deep enough so that when I had Daisy she didn't flick all the bedding out. Then she's got their treat up there which they've actually started eating. They've got their water bottle, 
they got this really cute Christmas ball that I got from Pets at Home in the sale. They got a jingly ball and they got an orange wood chew. They got a bowl of mealworms just because earlier they really wanted some treats and I didn't want to give them any um, until later on. So I thought I'd just give them some mealworms to, you know, hold them over because they're uh, treataholics. Then up here they've got their Sputnik and then inside they've actually got um, like a ripped pillowcase and it's quite an old one. Um, it's not going to focus, but um, they've basically bedded it so it's really comfy. Then my dad bought them this hammock which is off eBay and it's really, really soft and it took them a while to like it but they love it. As you can see there's treats on the top over the back there um, and then they're inside and so they can go on the top and then go in there. Then over there, they've got this really cute rope. My friend, not my sister, sorry, my friend was about to get rats and she ordered something online and she got two of the same product, so she gave me one. Then they've got their swinging ball, which you see every time. That thing that I call a hula hula. <laughs> um, then they've got their woodlands log thingy and they've got like a sack that hangs there. Then they've got their chew, like that. On the second level, they've got two food bowls. They've got a blue one, which has Pets at Home nuggets in it. And the red one has Selective Supreme rat nuggets in it. And they have this Christmas dangly toy, but I don't really think it's Christmassy. I just think it's really pretty. So then they have an apple chew. They have another jingly ball. They have another chew, a little bit of a tunnel there. They have a loofah, which was actually a hanging toy that they've taken apart. They have another Woodlands toy and a pink fleece blanket, so it's a different texture on their feet. So, yep, yeah, that's that floor. And then down there, they just have their mirror. I call it the daisy mirror. And then they have a chew and a tissue box that they've had fun with. And then this is the nest that they've made. So, you can see they've chewed all that fleece. They kind of wrapped it up and made it really nice. I'm pretty sure you want to see the ratties now. They're in here. Oh, there's one in here, just one. This is Cookie. I just put my light on so that you guys can see her properly. Do you guys like her bum? Hello, beautiful. Hello. Oh, sneezes. Did you want fish sneezes? Oh, oh. And then this is Oreo. <laughs> She's a lot bigger, actually, than um, Cookie. Oh, why is she sneezing so much, poor little bubba? But yeah, they are very tame. Where is she? Hello, pretty kid. Hello, pretty. Hello, pretty. Where are you? Come, are you coming? Are you going to come say hello? So basically, guys, I'm really excited to start making some more rap videos for you. Um, because these girls are lovely. Um, if you guys want to see um, some videos of how I tamed them, just leave me a comment down below or like this video and I will make that for you because it was so easy. And I'm sure like a lot of people worry about when they're getting rats, how they tame them and how, you know, how will they be friendly, will they bite. So if you guys want to know some questions, like just leave them down below, I'll answer them or I'll give you a, a rat fact video whatever you want just like this video and i'll do some rap videos or leave me some comments down below so then i can just do them for you but yeah they're lovely little babies isn't she so cute where's oreo gone she's in here somewhere there she is hello what are you doing So you can see though, um, Cookie is completely black and she has a line of white on her tummy and Oreo is there. She's black and white so she looks like an Oreo which is so cute. Hello! Actually guys, Oreo is the more friendly one so I don't know why she's there. She must be camera shy. It's the first time on camera. Cutie. So that is my rat update. Um, I'm going to be having a guinea pig one after this. So just stay tuned. It's coming. Don't worry. Just give me some time. Hello. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, I love her. <laughs> See you soon.